No, no, no. Not like that. And like that. <laughs> it doesn't even tumble if you throw it at Raz. Anyway, hello guys and welcome back to Let's Play Psychonauts with Miox Fu. And last time. Oh shush. Last time we made our way further up the asylum. Oh, and we found a few brains. I didn't mean to go that way. I thought we would actually go the other way. Like that. There is a Psy Challenge card over here. And this is actually the way we have to go. <laughs> We've only got a few brains left. Who is this? Nils, I think? To think that every cell in Nils' brain Aha. is dedicated to the ladies. I was right. I recognized him by his bowl cut. Well, 70s bowl cut. It's not really man darky enough to be a real warning. bowl cut. Go back down right now or you'll be very, very sorry! Actually, you can hear more of the Timmy Turner in her voice in this one. By the way, she, Tara Strong, she also did Timmy Turner's voice from Fairly Odd Parents. Yeah, you can hear it a lot in that voice. <laughs> Yeah, like I'm going to turn back after all this? I don't think so. I really wonder if there's something you can do in this loading screen, because... Oh, well, you'll find out soon enough. Quite soon enough, actually, I should think. What? Ya yeah, damn crow. <sighs> Through dealing with you guys. You know what, I'm going to use clairvoyance and invisibility. Oh, I need to get out the feather, don't I? I'm just curious what. I'm not getting it. Oh. I must be. I guess we should just go up here. Now. Okay, he just sees me as me. Hmm. Well, you know what I think about you, Crow, and your your annoying tossing me down the stairs like that. I mean, geez, I was just coming here to liberate my friends. Get out of here. Can I throw you off? Get out of here. Get out of here. <laughs> no, we can't do anything to the crow. We can do anything we want to any other bird, squirrel, whatever. Just not to this crow. Ooh! Actually, we almost got him off there. I'm expecting that we can jump off, but just not the crow. <laughs> well, I guess that's as close as we're gonna get. No, we can't press the button. Too bad. How can something as small as Vernon's brain hold so many boring stories? Hey, Vernon's stories are in-depth and very, very detailed. Worthless. So These yes, brains boring. are worthless, Shigal. <laughs> just like the one in your head. <laughs> They're nice! They're, they're nice brains, Dr. Lobato! Really? They're too nice! They won't fight! I need killers! I need angry brains! I squeeze them! I poke them! I twist them! What do I have to do to make them fight? Maybe I should try my drill. I'm not gonna bring you any more brains if you're gonna be so mean to them! No matter what I do? No! Not even if I... No, oh, not even if I cook away. you a little... Doctor, no. A little turtle soup? Please, Dr. <laughs> no! A nice hot turtle soup. Mm -hmm. Nothing better on a cold night like this than some boiling hot soup. You leave Mr. Pokey alone! Oh, okay. <laughs> you sure? No! I mean, yes! <laughs> All right. Actually, she oh, sounds more like I bubbles. Another role she did. It's made of turtles! Turtles that you love! Isn't that right, Mr. Foggy Low? Okay. Oh yeah, that's definitely bubbles. <laughs> well, maybe I'll just make some for myself. Bring me a good brain, Shigo! <laughs> or Mr. Foggy Low becomes Mr. Smoky Loaf! Aw, <laughs> uh, he's actually concerned, like, right now. I love his earlier expression, just like, Smokey Loaf! <laughs> the heck's going on? <laughs> when you're a dentist, you have to learn to have a sense of humor, you know? 
It helps to calm the patients down. <laughs> Probably Dr. Lobato's finest line. <laughs> So, he's got Agent 9 and Vodello in his cap- in his, uh, as his captive audience. Can we just- Aha! Nope! What's this? Can't just run in. Why, it's a nice little precious juicy brain! Wrapped up in some sort of boy-shaped goggly gook! <laughs> Soon have all that excess tissue removed, and then we can slip that brain into something more comfortable. Shigar! That package General Oleander mentioned has arrived. Please take it up to the holding area and keep it fresh until I'm ready to stick in my thumb and pull out a plum! <laughs> <laughs> I just love how... Listen, the man you're working for is a deranged lunatic. I know! I hate him! But if I don't do what he says, you... you... Cook your little turtle from the inside out. <laughs> <laughs> she or hostage situations like this are always extremely delicate. I'll have to extract Strack Pokelope from his prison using my psychic powers. After which, this Lobato character should be fairly trivial to neutralize. Yes, because once we get Mr. Pokelo back, he'll tell us what to do. He always tells me what to do. <laughs> yes. The build-up to this joke is amazing. I, like, I can't... Sasha. I can't even. Mia. Lily. Raz, you came. Of course I did. We gotta get you out of here. Look. The coach must have lured Sasha and Mia here on official Psychonauts business and then ambushed them with sneezing powder. Oh, God. They're completely brainless. I can tell. I know. I saw their brains downstairs. Listen, first things first. I was thinking about what you said about us making out. Yeah? Oh, man. I'm so glad he showed up. I was just starting to feel slightly less phlegmy. <laughs> Wait. He didn't just hear. <laughs> away from me. Stop reading my mind. Go rebrain Sasha and Mia so they can help us break this lock. <laughs> hey, come on. When you're among psychics, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta play, you gotta just roll with the mind reading, the telepathy, all that. So I think we go look at these guys. All right. Yeah, it's still the same. Same image as we saw before. Uh, Raz is the younger nine, and Raz is the baby for Mia. Can we break these? Yeah, we can. Okay. And I don't think. Man, that lock's tough. Oop! I didn't yeah. mean to set you on fire. I think we're definitely going to need Sasha and Mia's help with this. I think. That is the only time that we get to see, well, her vision of Raz. I don't think there's any other time that we meet Lily, actually. At least not with clairvoyance. So, and what about you? Okay, Raz is Jesus. <laughs> I can roll with that. <laughs> Alright, couple more brains. These ones just lying out in the open. Welcome They'll be back taking to the care of them. World, eh, you know, Shigor... He's not the best caretaker, I guess, but, you know, I'll work with what I have. And hopefully... Elton, what can I tell you? You were right. The old legends were true. Ah, uh, yes, the lungfish legends. Hopefully, we've only got... Or is that all the brains, actually? That is all the brains! So, before we do anything else, we've got some bacon to call up. We've got some bacon to call up. There we go. Again, I love that you can see Crawler's head before he actually pops up. And we got to regroup. I need to regroup back at HQ. We got some brains to brain. 
<laughs> Can we do anything with this screen? No? Oh well. All right, here we are. First things first. I do we have the? Cores? I still need to buy a side core at the camp store before I can use this machine to make side challenge markers. Oh well, too bad. But let's make some mental cobwebs into the cards. We have enough for three side cores, I think. Maybe four. Come on, thirty-six, thirty-six. Oh, just enough for four. All right, so we gotta go to the camp store before we head back. Get some Psycores, because we are right at level 73. Four Psycores, that puts us up to 77. Get the Levitation bonus. I'm not getting anything. Oh, no, I don't want that. I want Levitation. Always keep I it on E. What was I doing? I was crazy putting it on something else than E. In fact, not having it on a hotkey at all. <sighs> Insanity. Never really took a look around this place. It's just bone and flesh colored. Almost salmon colored. Oh, come on. Get up there. Alright. Let's get some, down to some rebraining. Good. Now? And that's how the coach is planning to take over the world. <laughs> wow. That is so not chill. Hey, where's Phoebe? We're going to be rebraining her really soon. Well, when she comes out, she's going to want to hit stuff. I better go wait by her drums. <laughs> and that's why we have to find Lily right away. That is some crazy stuff, guys. I'm kind of glad I was out for most of it. Well, with the world ending and everything, I should probably go see what girls want to make out one last time. <laughs> so I said, Always the ladies, man. I don't even know her. <laughs> <laughs> Crystal. So that's who's been kidnapping all the kids. Oh, man. I just want to burn that coach. Hey, where's Quentin? He's waiting for you at band practice. He better not be painting the wrong band name on my drums again. <laughs> no, I promise you. He didn't drool at all. Is Milka okay? Yeah, she's waiting for you down by the docks. Gotcha. Hey, do you want to help us save the... Okay, is making out all anyone thinks about in this place? <laughs> Pretty much. Come on. You guys are like what? The hideous hooking lungfish 12, 13. Of Lake hmm. So, does the coach, uh, does he have an evil sidekick? <laughs> a yes man? Or a lick spittle? Anything? <laughs> Not sure. Why? Uh, no reason. This is probably one of my I... favorites. Just because of that. Scared. You better believe I was scared. You'd have to be a fool not to be. But the trick is to never let them see you sweat. Wow. I guess that's what those squirrels were trying to tell me. Huh? <laughs> they kept saying the tiny man is gonna kill everyone. I thought they were talking about me. <laughs> oh, man. I have to go apologize. Although Dogen's takes the cake. That's a good question. It's a long joke. But I didn't taste it, so I don't really know the answer for sure. Well, if Brain Tank come after Mikhail, it will be sorry. Better go find Tiny Boss, see what his plan. And then the lungfish ate me and we became best friends. Oh my god. I know. I mean, oh my god. <laughs> I know. <laughs> yes, and because you got your brain stolen and I didn't, yes, I do. I think I'm better than you. Aha! I knew it! Well, you're wrong! Have fun dying! <laughs> They're all and good, so though. so that's what happened to your brain. Wow, what an amazing story. I mean, that is a really, really good story. And you know what the best part is? I'm in it. I better go write that whole thing down before we all get killed. <laughs> and that's how I earned all my merit badges. OMG! I feel so stupid for throwing myself off the roof now! What? 
Why did you throw yourself off the roof? Because the poison didn't work. Listen, I have to go. The world could use some major league cheering right about now. Well, at least they're helping Agent a bit. What is the current situation? We are I better go. completely rebrained. Lots of work to do. Good luck, Rasputin. Looking good. Oh. Although my frame rate for some reason is not. Come on. Jeez. Do a little rebrainings and computer thinks that it can take a break. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Well, hopefully that fixes it. Anyway, let's go. Well, we gotta get some psi cores. So let's go do that. Oh, jeez. Almost ran right off the edge. Where would you like me to take the agent crawler? Take me to. Drop me yeah, outside the main lodge. Oh. Right outside the main lodge. Me back a good. burger this time, will you? I will. You've been quite the companion. You've helped me quite a bit through these troubling times. But who am I kidding? You can't eat a burger, so I don't know where I'd put it. <laughs> Just mash it up against your voice. Uh, thing. <laughs> your vo- your... Voice box? Voice generator? Voice graph? Whatever. So let's get those energy cores. I'm going to pick up a few, uh... Actually, how much do we have for arrowheads? 40. I don't hey, think I'm going to be picking up much, good. actually. Mm, now, you take that side core there, yeah, yeah, put yeah. it together it? with nine side uh, cores. I take think it. we're just going to be so buying the side cores. The big -headed kid with the gloves. What else going to do you for? Alrighty then. I don't feel like... What else going to do you for? Excellent choice. Uh, looking what for arrowheads do right for? now. <laughs> so. Excellent choice. What else going to do you for? That's it there for we go. now. Alright. Hey, where are you stopping? Oh, I back. thought you stopped. No, 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 no. Let's go. Hey, want to help me save the world? Nah, I feel pretty good letting you take care of that. I'm sure you I love got how that you can just... under control. I gotta practice for the big celebration afterwards. You can just go hey, around talking to people now. World? Not now, Raz. I'm trying to finish writing my memoirs before we all die. And they'll just give you excuses as to why they can't help. Uh, I'm trying to think. Are there any really funny ones? I don't think so. But something I did miss out on, apparently with the crow feather, <laughs> you can tickle people. <laughs> Doesn't do much, but <laughs> Vernon's is quite the laugh. Uh, I'm not gonna wear my costume here. People will think I'm crazy. I'm not Maybe gonna I wear want my to wear here. the costume. Come on. <laughs> People will think I'm crazy. Think whether we can get Ford Crawler with it. Can we? Doesn't seem like it. I actually didn't know we could jump back here at all. Huh. I guess I never tried. Maybe if we tickle the main Ford Crawler. After all, we have to go back there anyway, so. Might as well check it out. Let's see if anything works. There we go. But, I think we're about, it's about time to call it another episode of Where Let's Play like Psychonauts me with Mio X Phil. And next time, now that we have everybody rebrained. I mean, my sanctuary. Yes, noble Psycho Master. And now that nobody's helping us, except for, uh, I can never remember her name, the girl with the fishbowl on her head. <laughs> She's helping us, sort of. She's transmitting on a distress signal to aliens, but I mean, it's more help than anybody else is giving us. <laughs> That's saying a lot. But, oh. Next time, we are going to see if we can My save. Empty. I need to go extract oh. more cobwebs from people's minds. Didn't mean to do that, I meant to do this. We're going to see what we can do to save Mr. Pokelope. 
so that Shigor can actually help us to you know, defeat Dr. Lobato any way we can. Aha! This is what I've been waiting for. This is one of the most useful upgrades that we're going to get, besides the, uh, the marksmanship upgrade, which hits like five enemies now, which is ridiculous and really helps out with the smaller enemies. Wrecking Ball. Basically, after a few seconds, it'll start glowing sparks like that, and it'll damage enemies when we run into them. Which makes smaller enemies just as easy to just, well, bowl over. So, before we get going... Cool, we can. Agent we'll just Clover, head back... What is the current situation? Into the field. I'm ready to go back into the field. Okay, let's see if I remember exactly where you were. Hope you do. I don't. <laughs> no, I know exactly where we're. We're right outside of Dr. Lobatos. That is the most convenient thing that they could have done for this game. I'm so glad that they have it. It's just a nice checkpoint system. I mean, it's not exactly where we started out, but it's good enough. Okay, good. <laughs> I wasn't sure if the crow stayed gone or not. Just before we head back to, uh, a little fight with Dr. Lobato. I do want to use the, uh, the feather. I think three more times should do the trick. Oh, four more times. I forgot someone. So let's uh, see. Gems. <laughs> so sad. <laughs> Not sure if they did anything else if you kept tickling them. Nope, just one recording. Oh well. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. And let's play Psychonauts. As we assault this seemingly impenetrable bubble that just lets him know, well, basically where we are. Alright, see you guys next time. Take it easy.